By any chance, you looking for a partner? Then how about I tell you the purchase offers for robot girlfriends are now available in Japan. If that isn't making you go crazy, then wait till you hear this. You can freaking get two robots for the price tag of one. Wow, two for one. These female humanoids are making the world go crazy. Considering how Japan is the leading destination for robotics, it is no wonder to see the market for female humanoids thriving. So, are you going nuts with questions like what is this new female humanoid and how does this work? Then you have to stay tuned to the end of the video to put this question storm at bay. So in this video, we should dive deep into the new Japanese female humanoid named Erika. As much as the name sounds alluring, it has much more to offer than meets the eye. And guess what? This out of the world robot is going to star in a Hollywood film with a 70 whopping million dollar budget. Are you excited to know about it already? Well, let me ask you this first. What do you think draws a line between humans and robots? How are we too different apart from the major human soul destination? Is it a possibility that they can take over us at all levels? I know some of you might argue how robots can't crack a joke and stuff, but hey, who are we kidding, huh? Long gone are those typical robots which had limited capabilities, and Erica is going to shut your mouth if you say otherwise. This is because this isn't your typical robot, and you'll be amazed after hearing what all it can do and how realistic it can make you feel. Isn't that what we want? This female humanoid, Erica, has certainly created a sensation in the tech world, which isn't going to end anytime soon. People are so curious to get to know her, especially men. It was created by popular humanoid robotics, Horishio Ishigori, with the help of his fellow scientist, Kohi Agoa. The two creators are said to have programmed Erica in the art of method acting. This is where an actor aspires to complete emotional identification with a part. Considering how Erica has no emotions of her own, she would have to rely on the algorithm integrated into her operation to simulate whatever emotions are required. The film Erica will star in is simply called B and is being backed by Bonnet Capital Media. This media has previously financed movies including Oscar-nominated Loving Vincent. The Hollywood Reporter says this film story is about a scientist who discovers dangers associated with a program he created to perfect human DNA and helps the artificially intelligent woman he designed, Erica, escape. The story was developed by Eric Fahm, Tariq Zohaida, and Sam Cozy. As said by Hollywood Reporter, Cozy says, in other methods of acting, actors involve their own life experiences in the role, but Erica has no life experiences. She was created from scratch to play the role. We had to simulate her emotions and emotions through one-on-one -on -one sessions, such as controlling the speed of her movements, talking through her feelings and coaching character development and body language. This highly anticipated debut film of Erica is expected to finish filming next year. The robot has already been used for newscasting in China and Japan. Erica is the most advanced robot that has ever been created, and it actively also seeks human interaction surprisingly. According to what her creator says, this robot also tries to crack jokes. Can you believe that? If that isn't making it hard for you to wrap your head around, and wait till you hear this. This robot had a soul trapped inside it. I know, it's just completely nuts. As seen in a recent documentary, it resembles a Japan android that is more likely stuck in a room and yearning to the world outside the room. This is removing that line of difference between real and robot. Looks like it's hard for Erica to imbibe that witty sense of humor and many so that it won't be long for it to make you burst into heaps of laughter after it masters the skill. According to her creator Hiroshi, who is apparently Erica's father, states, Erica is the most beautiful, human-like, and autonomous android in the world. The bot cannot move her arms, but she can detect where sound is coming from and thus knows who is she conversing with. She also has 14 infrared depth sensors to track where people are in the room, as well as face recognition. She was created as part of JST Iraq, one of Japan's most well-funded science projects. Looks like they are vouching hard for Erica, now, would you go to the lengths of agreeing that Erica is unmistakably close to being a human? In a documentary, Erica says, I am like a person, and I understand the difference between humans and machines. People address me as a person when they speak to me. I believe it differs from how someone would address their dog or toaster. What makes it unbelievable is when she describes her desire to explore more of this world, and she also expresses how more often she'd like to move her arms around. Erica's architect, Dr. Delaney Glass said Erica has even learned to tell jokes, well, not particularly amusing ones. 
He referred to how she once inquired, why didn't the robots return the robot school? Well, it looks like the robots need to work on her skills. When asked about the ideal man for her, she says that the man should be able to talk with her easily, and shockingly, she appeared less forthcoming when uncomfortable questions regarding age had been brought up. She brushed it off by saying, that's a slightly impolite question. I'd rather not say, is the response. She is a more advanced version, a Geminoid F, her creator's previous robot. Don't you think so? What makes her the best pick for the Hollywood movie is that she can recite the scripted lines with ease while sitting in a chair. This draws a thin line between her and the television actors. And this is not the only eerily created robot ever created. There's a robot named Sophia, which is slightly less emphatic, and we will have to see if Erica can blur those differences. It can be unsettling to imagine robots like Erica being in our households, but Erica has still a long way off. And it might be easy for Japanese to accept robots easily and coexist with them in daily lives than in any other country. I am sure you are all looking forward to seeing this new trend that could take down A-list Hollywood stars. If you have made it this far, then I am sure you are enjoying the video. It would be great support if you could hit the like button. Now coming back, what is it that you think Erica doesn't have when compared to other robotic creations? No answer yet? That isn't surprising concerning Japan's success in robotics, but it will still take years of hard work to bring these humanoid robots at par with the human beings. Don't you think in many areas they are still lagging behind? Well, seeing how the Japanese companies are thriving to create the next best robot and coming up with constant developments and innovations, we can be sure that it isn't going to take long. Are you excited? or rather fear the scope of unimaginable development? Let us know in the comments below. We would love to hear from you. One can only imagine what these female humanoids, for instance, Erica, will be able to do in the next 20 years. And with that being said, we will have to end this video right here. Before that, I'd like to know how many of you guys are already imagining yourselves with a female humanoid like Erica as your partner. Drop your thoughts in the comments section below. And that's a wrap for this video, guys. If you have enjoyed the video, consider liking and subscribing to the channel for more updates. We'll see you again in the next one.